1920. So when we start working with them, we have to be patient and we have to be uh, focused in, in work, in, his, in, in, their, in their balance, in their ability with the hands and in their coordination before playing basketball. Because if you, don't, if you are not able to control your body, it's difficult to, to control your body with, with the ball, with players around you and with the basket behind. So first we will talk about some exercises of coordination and, and uh, balance, and then we will talk about uh, how we will play in, a, in the low post. Uh, when we talk about playing back to the basket, back to the basket, uh, we have to realize that this is the, 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 most, uh, the most difficult uh, zone to play because the rest of the players, when they, when they receive the ball, when they grab the ball, they are facing the basket. They can look everybody, your, the teammates, the defense. They have the ball in, in, his, in their hands and they can, they can drill, you know, they can pass. And they are looking at the same time, the main in defense and the basket. When you are playing here, in the low post or in the middle of the zone, you are back to the basket, you don't know what is your main in defense, you don't know where are the rest of the team, you have to ask for the ball, you have here a line that don't allow you to go in this way because it's, it's cut, it's cut the way there. And when you receive the ball, sure you will have your men in defense and one, two, three men helping. So you have to, to be very, with a very good balance and good coordination to move very fast to attack the ring. Okay, we talk ab about this later. Then when we mm, ask the players grab a ball and make uh, 50 shoots, I'm sure that they will take the ball and start shooting from outside, maybe from three points, but nobody will be here shooting hooks. Everybody play outside, face to the basket. But the real thing is that maybe 90% of the shoot that you will make when you play inside the zone will be grab a ribbon and with one hand touch the ball in one rebound, receive the ball and make a hook. So we have to practice this kind of moves. If not, it's very difficult to uh, try to do it well in, during the game if you, we don't practice during that's in the week. So first of all, all of you with one ball, it's one, come here, big man and a small man, everybody. Come on. It's early in the morning, but we are awake. Come on. Uh, we need one, one wall. I don't know if this one is, is good for us. Let, let pass me one ball. One ball, it's one of you. It's Okay, it's uh, come on, come here. When we play close to the ring, many times there will be just a, a touch to to put the ball over the ring. So we need a very good uh, fingers uh, with a good sensation and with good uh, touch. So we we'll start with the arm extended and just. Doing this, okay, with the finger, with the right hand. Come on. Okay, now with the left hand. Okay, now changing from left to right, left, right. So you have to push the ball stronger. Okay, now uh, every player with two balls, just half of you. One ball is him, okay? Both at the same time.
Come on, just with the fingers. Strong, dribbling, bounce. Now, alternative. One first, one the other. Okay. What are we looking for with this thing? Touch. Feeling the ball in the fingers. Be, be able to receive here the ball and just touch and give the ball the right direction to go inside the, the ring. So it's important. Okay, great. Come here. <coughs> Come here. It's enough. Now, one in front of you, in front of the other. One ball, one ball. Okay. We have to pass him okay, with just with one hand. You receive the ball with one hand. Okay. Right hand. Come on, pass me. With the right hand. Okay. Up. With the left hand. Okay, good direction. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, now with two balls, two balls. Like the up, in. Same time now. Okay. Okay, now the same thing, but in motion. Come here, here, no, you, just you. Come on. Have to move around there, come back. Come on. Okay. Do it. We are trying to work in the coordination with the hands and with the, f with the feet and in motion. Great. Stop. We just one. We just make once every exercise. If not, we don't. We will not have time. Now, we are the three. The three with two balls. Two balls I'm here. I'm here. So, you have to pass me, receive the ball with the right hand, and pass you. You pass him, okay? And moving, moving, come on. Okay, right. Do it. Hey, the ball over your head. Now with the left. Whoop. Pass me the left. Okay. Great. So we kept, keep on working with both hands. Now, I want you to, to run. Around half court, okay, over the line, one step in this side, one step in the other, okay, cross, cross, running, at the same time dribbling, okay, give me the ball, okay, yes, come on, with the right hand, With the left hand. And now, back, back. Space, hey, 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 hey. take your time. Vamos. No, no. Come on.
Okay, stop. I mean, we can work in every kind of exercise of coordination to look for his best in uh, every move that they have to make because when you receive the ball here, maybe you have to turn, dribbling, twist with four guys around. So as, as much balance you can have, much better you will play here. One more exercise. Easy. This, very, this is very easy. You will be in the line here. With two balls, you have to go to the middle and come back. And you have to wear both balls, one over the other, like this. Okay? You put the ball like this, and we have to go to the middle. Okay, it's easy. And come back. Come on. It's easy. Hang on. Then, hey, that's not. Just grabbing the ball down. Hey, balance. Bend your knees. <laughs> Come on. Almost, almost, almost. <laughs> Why you have so many problems? <laughs> Oui. You don't have to look the ball, just move with, with it. Now, one more. This is easier. Two balls, one hand, okay? Have to go to the middle. Uh, you put the ball, uh, how do you say, tirar? Throw the ball to the air, okay? And go. Oh. Uh, okay, let's do it. Come on, play. <laughs> okay. I think we have to, you you have to keep working on this exercise. Okay? It's not it's not so difficult. You will learn very easy. But if that is much easier, it's easier if you do whatever Always with a good balance. Bending your knees and try to move fast. If you are standing, your legs are standing, it's very it's much difficult. And the last one of this one, man, come come here. This is just to for you to realize that when we ask for something for the players, sometimes or we have not practiced the the uh, the movement enough, or maybe they are not able to do what we ask for them. This is just very easy. I want you to grab the ball, and from here, I want you to hit the glass. Okay? Just like this. Easy. Come on. Oh, miss. Oh, miss. Oh. Great. Stop, stop. 
It's easy, but they are not doing it. What happened? It's not the same if you grab the ball, one, uh, one foot in front, one behind, my hand there, and boom. Okay, like a baseball, it's boom. You are doing like this. Ooh, no. Good move, good move, and you will reach. Okay, try to do it in the right way. One foot in front, one behind. A point where you want to to hit and go after the ball. Try. Come on, try. But follow the follow the ball. Why, why, why you stay? Here, no, follow the ball. F follow, go after. Okay, imagine you are at the end of the game, you are two points, okay, <laughs> you are two po one point down, you are in a three free throw, in a free throw, okay, stop, you are in a free throw. And you asked for a timeout and you said, stop, stop. If we grab the rebound, hey, stop. If you grab the rebound, you run and you have to make a long pass. You have to receive and score. We have two seconds. And we are not able to have a, pa a pass to the glass from the middle of the car. So maybe we have to practice this kind of long passes. Okay problems with this. I thought you were good players. What happened? Okay. Okay, sit down one moment. <coughs> okay. Uh, one of you. Just one of you with two balls. One of you. Come on. One ball one more ball. One more ball. Okay, now, for example, we can work on you are dribbling, bend your knees, dribbling, okay, and I pass you, you back. Okay. For example, okay, one, one other, other one exercise can be you are dribbling and you push the ball out, okay. Now the same, but changing the ball of the hands. The same with one uh, tennis ball and dribbling and put the ball in the air. The same in front of the wall, dribbling and pass the ball. Doing the same exercise that we have done before. Okay. All kind of ideas that you can have for, for them to have a good balance and a good uh, hand touch, it's okay, stay there. It's okay for us. One more thing. Uh, Two players, one ball. No, two players, two balls. Come here. Vamos. Two players, two balls. We are we work now on your ability to spin, to move. Okay? Just a minute. So you will be in the middle. He has one ball, I have one ball. He will pass you the ball. You are bending your knees like this. Pass me the ball. You just push it back, turn. I will pass you, push it back, turn. Okay? No, no. Closer. Ay, venga. Rápido. Faster. Come on. Hey, hey. Abajo. Aquí. Venga. Ponte tú.
Hey. <laughs> Put the ball up, come on. Hey, hey, no, stay. That's it. Okay, now with the left hand. But bend your knees, come on. And when you turn, jump. No. Okay, mega. Okay. Okay. Great. We can do this in the low post with more players, with more balls, but it's it's a good exercise to get accustomed to just jump and turn. Okay? No small steps. Great, enough here. Now, uh, we will always walk back to the to the to the basket, but it's true that we have to teach them how to shoot. With the big guys like me, when I was young, it's difficult to coordinate everything. Many of Many times the kids shoot with with the elbow open, shoot with the mon m hand in front, shoot with two hands. Uh, many times the coordination between uh, jumping and shooting is not good. So you jump and when you are going down, shoot. You jump from the chest to, to, to work on all this kind of uh, drills for shooting. One, please. We start with a very easy exercise, okay? You are close here in the blue line. Bend your knees, okay, ready. I will pass you the ball. Bueno, you pass me the ball. You receive just with one hand, the, the hand you use to shoot, okay? With one hand, you receive the ball, then from the straight position, you go to the bend, the balance position, like this, okay, and then shoot with one hand, okay? Okay, great. If you have to receive the ball with one hand and put the ball on the top, it's impossible that you put your elbow here or that you shoot with two hands because it's there. So the best option to start learning how to shoot, receive the ball with one hand, put the ball up, and then shoot, okay? So we can do it three, four times. Come on. Great. Bien. <coughs> Now, when you receive, pass me the ball, when you receive the ball and you go up, put both, both hands for shooting, okay? But don't, you don't shoot, just pass me the ball again. Pass me, pass me the ball, okay? Up, with one hand. No. Pass me. And now, okay? You, the ball up with one hand and then put the other. Okay. Okay, now you receive the ball up and then jump, but don't shoot. All right. Okay, now you receive ball up, jump, jump and shoot. Jump to the basket, okay? With balance, jump to the basket with the ball up. Okay, great. The same, jump to the side. Okay. 
I don't stop anymore in this uh, movement because it's face to the basket and I want to work in the back to the basket. But I mean, it's important, good balance, it's important, good hand, it's important the elbow with the front foot in the same line, the wrist and finishing with the hand on the, on the ring, into the ring, okay? Again, good job. Uh, now, we, I need a bit, one, two, couple, no, three. How big men do we have? Four? Come on, big men's here. Man. Uh, it will be very important for us how we use not only the fingers, if not the, uh, the effect that we give to the ball. I mean, it's not the same. Uh, come arriving very fast and shoot very high, that arriving low and shoot from, from down to up, that shooting back, <laughs> back to the ring. So we need to, to learn how to use the effect of the balls, of the ball. So we start here, okay, and I want to do this, okay. Just with the with your arm stand it, try to make it like a sp like a hook here, one the first one. Come on. Big uh, big circle. Okay. Next one. Back to the ring. Let me see. You have now a reference there. You can take a look at the other ring if you want. Finish, finish the like this. Whoop. Okay. Don't uh, wait. Don't shoot from here. Don't shoot. Okay. No. I want you to make a big circle. Okay. Circle. Oh. Mm -hmm. Not to the glass, to the ring. Okay, now you to the ring. Okay, shoot to the ring, uh, to the glass. How much the ball twist, how much be the effect to go to the ring? This way? Maybe the other, maybe like this, <laughs> try. The other. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, <laughs> in the other way. <laughs> if you you make like this, the ball goes out. <coughs> to the middle. It's like a pool billiard. You don't play? You just play PlayStation? I mean, uh, every kind of exercise that we can do with uh, FX to finish when we make a layup, it's very important because when you, sometimes I play with players bigger than me. For example, uh, when I play against Arvida Sabonis, is two meters 20, or Patrick uh, Femelin, I cannot shoot over them. So I use this kind of shoot under his arm, and I shoot like this. 
So I need the effect for the ball uh, climb over the over the ring. So it's important to work with that kind of thing. It's not the same if you push the ball in the middle that if you push the ball in one side, it goes in another direction and it's uh, twisting in a different way. So you have to work in in the front and in the back. Okay, wait. It's important the effect for the final shoot. Bien. We will work on them with the big guys from the beginning with this exercise. Just in front, in front of the glass, okay, with the ball here, one step and shoot. Okay? One step and shoot. Like the fine find the final shoot of a layup. Okay, come. No, oh, three, uh, three more balls, please. Balls, balls. One here. Please, here. Two here, two here, two there, two here. Okay, vale. yes. Shoot. With the right, with the left. That's, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's it. Keep doing. Please take a look at their, at their knees. The knees. Okay, stop. Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but when they shoot, I only ask them from here, just one step and shoot. It's the final when you make a layup. Okay. Well, your knee, your knee must be high because it's like if you are making a, a jump high, like, like this. The knee will will drive you up, but you are shooting like this, like this, and with the foot instead of in the same line, out. It's impossible to jump high like this, or like this. So you have to put your knee up in the same line and shoot. So try it again. Your knee out. That's it. It's what we talked yesterday about the details. It's very important the details. Hey, left hand. Okay. Great. Okay, now we arrive to the exercise that we always do before we start the practice with the big men's. Okay, the, it's a drill that George Beacon always do, always did with, he, with his big men. I'm sure that you will have made it before. Yes. With the ball here, okay, it's here, here, here. Have you did it before? Do it. Space. Leave him alone. <coughs> okay. Remember, knee up, the foot on the floor just a little to the ring because you want to finish tur turning to the ring and one arm is shooting and the other one is protecting. No? Again. Okay, next one. No, nope. you see, see, vale, next one. Vale, next one. Vale, bien, we will try with many days of practicing to do it, this very, very fast, very fast. F uh, feet on the floor must be just tutun, tutun, 
very very well, very fast, and just with the front part of your of your foot of your feet. But there are two things that you have to do always. First, your knee. Okay, the knee must be up. Okay, but the second is when you protect the ball. Come here. When you protect the ball, you are shooting. And shooting. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. When you protect. Get. Hey. Hope. This this arm. You are using the arm like this to protect. Okay. Instead of being like this, you use your arms like this. You will be much stronger. I don't want you to push the men in defense, but look the difference here. Be strong. Be strong. Okay. Be strong. And turn. Let me back. Be strong. Be strong. Okay. You are mo much more stronger like this than like this. So when you protect the ball here, okay. So you have this space to shoot. Why we need the hook to play when we are smaller than our offense, our men in defense. Because if you shoot in front of me, face to me, shoot, I will block, no, wait, wait. I will block you with this hand, with this hand, with both hands, okay? It's what happens to me years ago. But if you are so perpendicular to me, you protect here and you shoot from, from, no point from here, the only way for me to block is to jump over the ring. So it's very important if you are not 2 meters 20, 2 meters 15, try to, to do the hook with two legs or with one leg, okay? Okay, understand coaches? Great. Now, we are talking about how we finish, but we have to receive the ball. Because we are not point guards, we are not with the ball from here to there. You know, we are running and arriving here and asking for the ball. So you have to ask here for the ball, and I will pass you. Shoot, do whatever you want. Next one, ask for the ball. Next one. Next one. This ring. Come on. Ask for the ball. Again, ask for the ball. Okay, stop. Who is asking more or less in the, w in the right way for the ball? Number one, number two, number three, or number four? Number one? No fans. Number two? Well, three or four fans. Number three? Number four? Uno, uno. The winner is number two. Yes, come on. <laughs> I mean, come here. You have uh, all of you, 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 maybe you are the best asking for the ball here, taking post up. It's, it's the end. Uh, because it's not just I want the ball, it's I have to, uh, to create a space and protect the space to receive the ball. The ball must go from the passer to me. If I just am here and I say, hey, give me the ball, but I don't defend this space, the defense will go in front of me and will take the ball when the ball is coming to me. So you too ask the ball, but this, this arm is here, is here. So if you are asking here for the ball, I post up, post up. With this arm down here, I can go in front of you. So you have to try to stop me with this, arms, uh, this arm here in my chest, in my chest, so I cannot go there, okay? One thing that you are doing is ask for the ball here. 
here. Here is very difficult. It's a long way. I have to show you my hand because you, you must always show one point to receive the ball, to the ball. And not with the arm closed, not with the arm open, with the hand closed, with the hand open. Why? Because if I ask for the ball, you, I'm asking for the ball, like this, it's like a, I don't want the ball, or like this. If I asking the ball like this, with two hands very spread, it's like I'm shouting, give me the ball, okay? So I'm here, I'm holding you with my arm, 90 degrees, bend my knees, give me the ball, okay? When the ball is coming, when the ball is coming, I grab the ball, but not before, because if I, I'm like this, and I put it away, the difference go over, okay? So I'm here, pass me the ball. I, when I feel the ball coming, I grab it, okay? Do it again. Then, come on. Next one. Next one. Next one. The next one. Here's the basket. Come on. Now, um, I have one one dapt, one dapt, very, very, very important for me. The ball is here. You have the ball, okay? You are here in the low post, in the low post. Often, you are in offense, okay? And the ball is there. We have one man there without ball in offense. The ball will, will go, will go from him to him, and you will ask for the, you will post up. Okay, give the ball to him. How are you? How is your situation? I'm here defending you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Again. Again, 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 again. No, the ball is there. The ball is there. Go there. Give the ball to him. Okay, swing the ball now. Swing the ball. Okay, so he's waiting for me here. I mean, he's in defense, and the ball is coming. He is waiting for me here, and when I arrive, he's in like this. Okay? Thing will be better for you, and will be easier for you to uh, post up and always receive the ball if, when the ball is there, when the ball is there, I'm face to you, okay? Face to you. When the ball is there, I'm still facing to you, okay? If the ball is there, how can you defense me? I'm, I'm, I'm face to you, okay? And the ball is coming in the air here, and in that moment is when I put my foot in the middle of your legs hold you with my arm and be perpendicular to you and ask for the ball. So I will always receive the ball if I'm facing to you. Why? Because if you want to defense me three quarters and the ball is there, I will say, pass me the ball and I will receive here. Okay? If you want to be in front of me because you are with the ball in front of me here, here, it's the same. I will say, you receive the ball and I will say, go back for me. Okay? And if it's a normal defense, you're here, the ball is coming, I mean, take, take. Great. So I want you now to stay facing the basket, and when I say one, you make like this, receive the ball, grab the ball, and make a, a movement. Again, vamos. All of you, give me the ball. Yeah. Vamos. Vamos, next one. Vamos.
Man. Next one. Come on. Again. Man. Now, <coughs> everybody knows that we have to, to ask for the ball, to receive the ball, when we are posting up here. So, right. I receive the ball. What do I have to do when I receive the ball? What do I have to do? Look, look, and why you don't look? But nobody of you, when you receive the ball and you make a movement, has to take a look to the middle of the, of the curve. Why? You forget? You don't know. The first thing, when you, when you receive the ball, you have first receive the ball. Then you have to uh, take, t take a look of what is happening around you. Where are your, your, your teammates in offense? Where are the defense? Then, when you take a look of every, everything, you decide what are you going to do. Take the decision. First look, then the decision, and then the execution. You, you do what you want to do. So the first thing, I receive the ball, take a look, and then start. Then. Why I'm looking at the middle? And why I'm not looking there? Eh? It's open there, right? If I take a look at the middle, I can see everybody. If I look there, I only can take a look to the wall and to the baseline. So I know that there is the baseline, so I don't need to, to take a look there. I have to take a look at the middle. So the first thing, I receive the ball, take a look at the middle. Okay, With, when I'm moving my head, the men in defense, come here, one of you, you. You ask for the ball, hey, wait, ball there. Espera, espera, wait, wait, aquí, aquí, y aquí. Hey, vale. Ask for the ball, grab it, and now take a look here. Okay, if you are looking to the middle, I have to be here in defense. Okay, if you just twist your head and take a look at this side, I will have to take, I will have to move myself because I, 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 I think that you are going this way. If I don't move, I'm still here and you take a look here, just you go there. So, with the movement of my head, I'm conditioning, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm doing that the defense has to move one side or the other. So I receive the ball. When I get defense me, I receive the ball. Take a look like this. You have to move. Then I come back, same side, OK? So now I want you to receive the ball. Look, fake, dribbling, and hook. Okay? Come on. Very easy. Bien. Don't move any of your feet. Yeah, but you have to believe in what you are doing, not like a robot. You take a look at the middle, then fake, and then go. When you make a fake, the fake must be slow. If you make a fake very, very fast, you don't give time the defense to react. I mean, you have to be very fast in the reaction of the fake. Give me the ball. You are defending me. Okay? You are coming here in a, in a close-up. And if I fake a shoot and I do like this, 
you don't have time to do anything. If you are coming and I make a good fake, you believe that I, you're, you, you think that I'm going to shoot, so you will jump, and I can have a very fast reaction to go and dunk. But the, the fake is slow, the reaction is very fast. So you receive here, fake, move. The difference must have time to move to stop there. Okay, again. Come on. Hmm. Well, now we will work in this situation from this post up in different technical movements. And now you will receive the ball, take a look at the middle, take a look at the baseline, and then spin and go and shoot. Okay? My. Uh, I will do it over this leg, the one who is far away from the basket. Here, spin move, okay? Vamos. No. You cannot move both at the same time. It's just take a look here and here. This is there, no move it. Vamos. No. Sí. It's okay. No. Okay. You will try, you have to try to do what I am asking you to do. Because now we are just, like if you have a good, uh, big back in your, in, your sh in your shoulder, a big back, and you are here putting a lot of things, a lot of movement that you then, when you control how to do it, will use here in a half second. But if you cannot do many things, when you are here around with three men in defense and you have to decide what to do, you, don't, you cannot decide because you only know how to do one thing. If you know how to do three, four things, it's much easier. So insist. When you take a look in the middle and go over this spin move, over this leg again. Come on. No. Vamos. Sí. Sí. No. No. Just pay attention. Here. Why? Come here. You have, you have the ball. You have the ball here. Grab it. Bend your knees. Okay, I'm in defense. And I'm close to you with my leg in the middle of yours. Which is your spin move. That's why. That's why I want you to learn how to do this. Because if the defense is like this, you are here, it's just go. Okay? Now, we change. You receive the ball here, and we want to make a shoot from here, okay? We go away from the defense, and we shoot. Always with bending your knees, the ball is up. I don't want you to put the ball down and then go up. No, I don't want you to stay down, receive, stay high, and come here. No, you are down, you receive the ball, down, and shoot, okay? Come on. <coughs> hey, I don't want, wait, I don't want this, no, I want this, hey, okay, 
which is how is the movement I have said we have to do? No. Huh? Face to the basket. Come on. Bien, venga, next one. Do it. A ver, one of you, come here. I need the passer. Receive the ball. Come on. Do the same. Bien, shoot. Next one. Next one. Oh. Thank you. Ooh. Next one. Oh, fall. Next one. Next one. Okay. That's why I don't want you to put the ball down. Because it's very easy for the defense when you are just one looking at the, the ring. If you put the ball down, it's easy to steal the ball. It's easy. So the ball always here. I receive the ball, the ball here. Okay? I will show you one trick. Come here. You want to steal one ball like this? And you have the ball and you, I want, you want to steal always the ball? Okay? If I want to steal the ball and I go with my arm like this, okay, it sounds a lot. Maybe the referee will call fall. I can touch your arm, it's fall. But if instead of going like this, I change my hand like karate, okay, grab it strong. Okay. Again, grab it. Strong, very strong. 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 Ah! <laughs> no. Be ready, be ready. Grab it. No, no, don't move it. I mean, I w I'm not going to hit you. The thing is that if instead of going plain, I go perpendicular, my arm touches the ball, it slips, it's, 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 and the ball is out, okay? And if we are fighting for a ball, what do we have to do? Huh? Push, pull, 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 no, not pull, just twist. Okay? If you are, you pull, 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 no pull, but twist, the ball is yours, okay? Pull. <laughs> okay, some little tricks. Uh, okay, so now receive the ball, up and shoot. We know how to do it. Receive the ball, take a look, go to the middle. We know how to do it. Now receive the ball, fake, good fake. It's not fake. It's a good fake without the body, with my legs, with my head, with the ball. When I'm jumping, one dribbling two steps uh, back to the ring, okay? Try. Vamos, a ver. Bien. Bien. It's okay. Good position. Ask for the ball. Great. Good fake. But look at my feet. Okay. My right foot is in front because I am a right shooter. You are faking like this. If I'm in defense, I know that you are not going to shoot. So I will not react to your fake because your foot is going two away. 
to fly away. So it's just here, fake. And then you can start again. Okay. Don't move that side. Great. Now we have to do the same in the in the opposite side. We will not do it now, but we will work in one side and always in the opposite, right and left. Okay. Now uh, you receive the ball. Pass him. Receive the ball. Take a look. Put the ball back. At the same time. At the same time, you give the ball there. Ask for the ball inside. Bounce, pass, and shoot. Okay. So first, have to receive the ball. Take a look. Take a look here. So you are here. Okay. You are. If I'm looking here, you will defend me. Okay. Then here. Boom. The same. You have to protect the space and ask for the ball. Come on. Again. Wait. Again. You receive the ball, and, hey, no, again. You receive the ball, and, 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 take a look at the middle. Yesterday, did you were in the tournament, watching the games yesterday? Many times, there was just one or two of actions in the low post. The rest always shooting face to the basket. But many times, the big man when received the ball, was like this. If you receive the ball, at least take a look, move your head, so the defense has to think something, but not just. Okay, so you receive the ball, take a look, so you have to move, you have to change your, your, your position in defense, then you go back and then. Okay, again, next one. Yep, again. Hey, no, again. Ask for the ball. Up. <laughs> you, 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 you want me to explain many details. I know. I know the trick you are doing. If, if, if you are here, you can hold me. Okay? If your arm is here, I will go through, sure. But, if you are defending me like this, I can go over because I know how to. Okay? Instead of fighting with you like this, I will put my arms like this in the top. Wait, 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 wait. In the top. Hold me. And I will do this move. Okay? And I'm in front of you. Okay? See if you you are fighting with me. I want to fight. No, 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 no fight. You, you fight with me. You, I don't have to fight always. I just like have to do this, and I'm in front. Okay, that's for this one, not for offense. Okay, ask for the ball. <coughs> At the same time that you are passing out, you have to move your foot. Venga. On. Where is your ball? <coughs> we need more work at the beginning with the hands to good have good hands and grab it. Come on, keep on doing. You forgot about your leg. It's okay. Okay, now you receive the ball here, bounce, boom, and shoot with the left and back to the ring. Come on.
Don't forget your arm helping you to protect the ball. Okay. It's bound once ship. Eh? Okay. Well, we work every day, not in all the things that we are doing today, if not just two or three things, because we, we must be focused in the details to help them to do the exercise well. Well, all the details. If we try to do every day uh, 12, 15 different skills, uh, it will be very complicated for them. So, just a few of them and the details. Then, what can we do now? We have learned how to ask for the ball, how to attack from the dribble, take a look at the middle, go with spin, open to shoot, and fake. With these three, four things, we can play ever. You have to learn how to do one thing very well, for example, the, uh, the right hook with, with one leg. And you have to learn the opposite thing, the left hook with one leg. Why? Because if I'm trying to do defense, my, my best move, right, right hook, and he knows it, and he defend me, I just have to do the opposite thing. So we will work in one and the other. It's very easy. Yesterday, one of the of the only uh, plays in the low post in the last game was like this. He received the ball here. I don't know who. Take a look at the middle. And he said, one dribble, two dribbling. The difference came here. He spin and an easy layup. So easy. But he only once in the game. He received the ball. Difference. One different here. Boom, boom. So we will try and work in these things. Now, one thing is how we work, the technical, and we have to teach them the tactical. We have teach them what to use, but now we have to teach them when, when they have to use, when. So, now, you will shoot from here, you will receive the ball, you will receive the ball, you will shoot from here, but if I am defending you and I am step back, you shoot. If I am close to you, you have to go to the basket. Okay? We are starting and working on tactical, individual tactical. Okay? Pass them the ball, pass him the ball, ask for the ball. Okay, shoot. Come on, next one. Come on, next one. Come on. Come on. Come on, next one. Next one. Come on. Yep, no, no, no. The other way. Bien. Up, 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 no. First, take a look around you. I'm going back. Shoot. Now. Okay, so we can work in this way with one defense and they offense and you. Uh, you are close to them or you are away from them, they have to shoot, or, the, or we can do it with the sound or with some signals, visual signals that the coach must, must use. For example, now you will receive the ball. If I say one, you have to shoot, okay? If I say one, you receive the ball and you have to shoot and you can shoot. 
away or you can shoot to the basket. If I say two, you have to go to the basket with a layup. Okay? If I th say three, you have to make a spin move. Okay? Maybe you are receiving the ball, you're going to shoot. I don't say anything and you shoot. But if you are facing the basket and I say three, you have to go to the basket, make a spin move and finish, okay? One shoot, two lay up, three spin. Start. Okay. One. One. Three. Three. Two. One. Okay. One. One. Okay. That's one example to work on things of tactical because they have to be ready to uh, listen what I'm saying. The same with uh, with my arm here when they receive the ball. If I, my arm is up, it's shooting. Here is layup. Here is uh, a spin move. Okay, so you have to take a look at the same time. What are you going to play? And me that I'm here. Okay. Okay. Spin. Okay, enough. So, any question? No. Well. We can make a lot of uh, exercises, always very simple, simple, because it, the simple thing, it's easy for them, and they will help a lot, because we can be in, on them with the small details, not very complicated. Just pass the ball inside and make a, a movement. Now, we can help them to, uh, in a running offense, how they have to move. For example, if I'm here, and one uh, teammate is going out, and I'm here making a screen, what can I do? For example, if my man in defense is helping a little, when he goes out, I will go in, asking for the ball, with this move over the defense, asking for the ball with both hands, receive the ball, and then, what can I do here when I receive the ball, depending on the defense? But now, receive the ball, and dribbling and hook with the left with one leg okay so i will be there passing you're here ask for the ball okay boom boom hook okay vamos uh, you pass me the ball from the low post no you have the ball in the low post okay and now you pass me the ball, okay. I prefer one with one leg. Tranquilo, take your time. Now, the screen, now, okay. How do you think that I will pass you the ball better? If you ask me the ball like this, or if you ask me the ball like this, like this, no? Don't ask me the ball like this, because I will not pass you. It's like if you are telling me, I don't want the ball. I will tell you now a story. Finish with this. Bigger. Ahí. The 
the screen. Well, let me come here. I had the teammate, the play in the low post, but he really that's, that's in, didn't like to play in the low post. And in, in that game, he was defending by a very big guy. So uh, the coach insists, please, you have to take the position, t post up, play against him and the rest of the team. You have to pass him the ball inside and then never receive the ball. Because when he asked for the ball here, he, he was like this, holding the men in defense, come here, defend me, defend me, strong defense. And instead of asking for the ball here, he was like this. <laughs> so we don't pass him the ball. I mean, if you want the ball, you have to ask for the ball, really. Give me the ball. If not, and I, I have played since I was 17 till I was 37, like professional. If you don't have lights in your head, like the police, you don't receive the ball inside. You can be sure. People from outside say, no, I'm not a very good passer. No, no, they want to shoot, always. And if you want the ball, you have to lights and <sighs> give me the ball, okay? Now, continue. You are here making a screen, ask for the ball. So, um, dribble, no, a ver. be there, pass me the ball. Okay. Here, give me the ball. Now, here and here, okay? The men in defense have come to the middle to stop you, so you spin with uh, the ball between your legs, strong, and a uh, jump hook. Come on. Protect the ball with the left hand. And now I'm always being the passer. It's, be it's better for them that they pass one to each other because they will learn how to pass and they will learn that it's not easy to pass inside if they are not with a good position. Okay, so now one up, one, yes, one up. That will be the passer. You the same. And I will be the defender. Okay? Screen, screen. Great. Pass him. Screen. Vamos. Again. Screen, screen, go. Your, your left knee has been here. You cannot jump. Remember, jump to the basket. It's important. Knee up. Next one. Screen. Vamos. You have to be ready to react. I mean, at the end, we must be ready to do something like this. I received the ball, pass me the ball. Okay, fake, 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 and shoot. Okay, that's not trouble. I only bounce one, but I'm ready for what can happen around me. I mean, I receive the ball and I fake, so the defense move. I'm gonna shoot, they rec recover here. I fake, he jumps. I go to the basket, 
but he recovered again. I fake, he jumps. I'm gonna shoot, but he jumps again because he's a great jumper. And then, at the end, there is nobody. Okay, if we can do this, you are ready to play inside the zone. Because I always be have one more option. I mean, fake, if you jump, go. If you don't jump, my fake is a real fake because I will shoot, not just a fake, f uh, fake, no. I want to shoot, you don't jump, I shoot. You jump, I go here. If somebody comes, I have, I can go spin, I can go whatever, hook, back to the basket, whatever. Uh, all these kind of moves that you see on, on the TV, on NBA, on, on the league here, it's not just, uh, uh, they imagine today and they do it. They have worked, all the players, before many days, many hours, to finish doing what they are doing in the, in the game. And uh, if you don't work, maybe, if you don't, real, if you don't make maybe 20,000 times one move, you will uh, keep on thinking on what you are you doing. And you need not to think when you are here, just in what that you want to make the, the basket and you have an advantage, but not think about what are you gonna do? How are you gonna do? Just in what are you going to do, but not in how are you going to do? Okay, I don't know if you understand me. You don't have to think in how are you doing the things, not what, what do I have to do and just do it. And, if, and, and in, in this step, think and do it, be between, there are many, many, many times the hook, the shoot, the fake, the whatever. Okay? One minute. Any questions? No. Hey! No, 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 please. Tell me. Well, uh, he asked me if the, any of these elements is for the outside players or just for the inside players. Uh, the, the today we are talking about the uh, working with the big man in the youth, but I, I have a big difference between working with the big man in the youth, it's all the coordination, proprioception and whatever, psychomotricity, and play back to the basket. Playing back to the basket is for everybody, because if I if I'm here playing, back to the basket, a post-up against Patrick Femmerlin, I'm not in advantage, I'm in disadvantage. But if, I don't know, he is a point guard, for example, he's a point guard, and he is a point guard, he is in advantage. So he needs to know how to play in the low post or back to the basket. There are many of them, like uh, uh, Raul Lopez plays very well in the low post. Uh, Mm, Ricky Rubio played in the low post also. And if you have advantage, you have to play, but you know, you, you must know how to play. It's, it's easy for the coach says, no, you have advantage, play in the low post. And the, the, he said, what do I have to do? So I will work as you work with the young players, face to the basket, shooting, dribbling, left, right, spin, with everybody in the low post, it's great. Now, two questions in the same moment? No. <laughs> Tell me. How you, how? Uh, how? How offensive player? It's a problem. <laughs> I mean, not, not everybody can, uh, can do it. Not, the, not always you can do it, but it's, it's just an, an option to hear. I mean, we are talking about offense, just in offense, but in defense there are many things that you can do. And it's like uh, when you play, or you run a, a system in offense and you have a defense like yesterday to, to cut the, the, the movement, the motion. Uh, if you are here and I want to go in front of you and I use this, this element to go through, uh, the only thing that you can have do is be stronger than me. And if you see that I'm put, mm, driving my arms up to come here, 
be smart. Be, be smart. Okay, if you if I see that he is doing this, move my body first to look for the path in, inside here. But it's it's difficult. It, this is just a fight. For example, we are fighting. Defense me. Come on, strong, strong. Uh, one ball here. Come on, one man here. Strong. No defense, man, in front, whatever. Come on, come on, try to be denying me. More in front, in front. Come on, come on, in front, be here. Come on, keep fighting, keep fighting, keep fighting. Okay, if we are fighting the whole time, never win. So sometimes we are fighting, fighting, fight, fight, in front, in front, in front. Come on, come on, man, come on, push me, push me. And I stand up. If I stand up, he said, I win. So he stand up. And in the moment that he stand up, I attack him again, <laughs> and I win. So sometimes the stop, it's very good in the fights. OK? One, <coughs> one more thing, for example. The ball is here, and I'm defending you. I don't have to be fighting with you here, because I will lose, because there are a lot of space. What do I have to do? push you to the baseline. If I push you to the baseline, there is no space to pass the ball because it's out. So when I'm fighting with you, fight with me, I have to try to push you, to push you here. So I deny. If the ball is there, the ball is there, I will do the, the opposite side, on the top. Okay? Yeah, I help. I have help here. <laughs> so it's difficult. Okay, so the ball there, push down. What happened in offense? The opposite thing. You are defending me, I will push you up. I will push you up and try to make more space here to receive the ball. Okay, uh, one trick, one trick. You, I defending you, you want to pass him. You want to, you don't. Okay, one in defense here. One in defense. You have to be very active with a lot of activity here with your arms, okay? Following the ball. So it's not an easy pass. But if you have a good, good post up here, maybe you receive the ball. What do I have to do? Just a stupid thing, but it, 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 it works. If instead of being with my hand here, I try to put my, my hand in the line from his eyes to his eyes, like this. If I cut the line, not like this, this is technical, but like this, no, not here, if not in the line, if they don't look one to each other, he will not pass. So sometimes, instead of being, it's just here, okay? One trick. And the last one in defense, give him the ball. If he is here grabbing the ball, if I want to steal the ball here, he will m make this move for sure. Okay? I'm going to steal the ball. You do this, no? So I'm going to steal the ball here, but really I want to steal the ball here. Okay? Pam, pam. Because when you are playing, you are not remember. Uh, no, he's faking me, no. He's faking here. You protect the ball, and I steal up. And the last one, okay, the last one. Come here, man. I post up you. We have a mismatch, and I post up you. What happened? You have to fail on me if you want to stop me. If not, it's an easy basket. A friend of mine, uh, Chichi Kreus, he, he told me, I have learned one thing, Juan. When the big man try to post me up, his dribbling are very low and very high. They are doing like this. So the only thing I have to do, you dribbling low is low and high. The only thing I have to do is this. Fuera. But I don't have to fall on him. Just put my foot on his dribbling because I have time. I'm faster than him and I am uh, smaller so I can go under. And the big man, I mean, I'm here. Try to do it. The big man. The big man is slow, okay? Don't kick the ball, it's technical fall. <laughs> That's uh, some tricks, okay.
Uh, it's time now. Oh. Well, well, we have many more things to talk about. <laughs> like, well, okay, uh, just uh, to finish then. We have been working in the low post uh, for many technical movements that you have to to work on them many, many times and always focusing that what they are doing is the right thing because they, if not, they will learn to do it m in the wrong way. Uh, technical things, then tactical things. You have to teach them when they have to use it. When, not just do it, do it, no. If he is away, you shoot. If he comes here, you go to the basket. If you fake and he reacts, you can go. If not, um, now we will. Now, my idea was to start in playing high post, low post. How can we pass one to each other? How how must we move when one goes to the baseline? The other one must go to the high. If you go to high or baseline, if there is a penetration, how do I have to move? All that kind of things we have to teach them, because if we don't teach the players, we cannot uh, expect that during the game they will do it. It's not easy. Remember what we do in the middle of the guard with a long pass. Everybody thought that they will hit the glass and just one. So don't expect much more than what we have practiced with them. Okay? Thank you.